What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to another episode of Rebel Racing. Ladies and gentlemen, the brand new update just dropped, and we want to have a look. I want to give you my opinion on the newest update and see what we think about this. So, uh, they introduced the passes. Passes, well, if you played, for example, um, Asphalt 9, Asphalt 9, then you probably will be familiar with the whole pass system. It's kind of like a mechanism which um, yeah, appeared, I don't know, some years ago in, in mobile games and so on, you know, if you play Rocket League and you get the Rocket League pass or something like this. However, that means that you constantly, for a certain amount of time, period of time, you get bonus points um, when you have the pass. So what do we have here? We got a Rebel Pro Pass, which costs $10.99, or we got the Veteran Pass, which costs $21.99, but I would recommend you to go for the Pro Pass. Just play a lot, and then you will get everything what the Veteran Pass will give you, and you save 10 bucks. So I'm thinking Pro Pass it is. Okay, so what are we getting? We get 100 ooh, gold keys, 50 gold coins, some parts, bronze, oh, 15,000 club points, Roof fusion credits, 25,000 club points, more fusion credits, uh, fusion credits, 50,000 club points, oh boy, and silver keys, 100,000 club points, so you're doing quite well, or 250,000, oh wow, okay, we're going all in with the club points here, and at the very end, you actually can win that beautiful, that beautiful roof, RT35S, which is, as you can see, modified, looks a little bit like a like a Liberty Walk Edition. Oh, and we got the Carrera Speedstar Crate. We're going in for that one for sure. Okay. Um, what else we got here? Off-road crate. Oh yeah, man. I want new off-roaders already. Don't tease me, man. Don't tease me. I want new off-roaders. And we got the new Rebel Smash event. The new Rebel Smash event looks a little bit different. Then, oh, we have a tier A off-road lab open letter. I know what I'm going to play soon. Uh, Rebel Smash event. So, how does it look like? It's different, apparently. Uh, if you remember previously, you were in some kind of arena mode with the Rebel Smash event, and you need to like drive through those boxes in order to gain points. And so, now it's different. Now, it, you actually drive on a track. So, what can we do? We can win this a Gold Smash crate. Free run, your first run is free, and you're going to see now, now it's going to look a little bit different. As you can see now, it's not in an arena, it's actually on a on a track. Plus, the boxes are mystery. Okay, hitting a box will reveal its point value. I think I like the one before a little bit more, where I could see... Okay, we use a Porsche here. I don't want to drive fast. Okay, which one should we... Can we, can we try with two? No, we can't, right? Uh, green, yeah, great. That wasn't so good. Oh, yeah. And, ah, perfect. Yes. Let's take our red. I don't want to use NOS because I'm afraid that I'm... No! <laughs> That's exactly what I want. Green, uh, red. Is it actually the one which is right next to it? No. It's a really bad idea to, to use the one which they give us there right away. What is this? Okay, let's take the this one. Yes! Okay, lucky. Can we take two stars? No, this is it already. Really? Oh man, that was bad. Seven boxes smashed. That's only one star. We're so close to the next one. If we wouldn't have missed the other one. Okay, Bronx crate. What are we getting? A little bit of cash. Oh, nice fusion credits. Stage 2 gear love. Okay, roof, uncommon shaft. Well, well, well. Okay, so, and if you run it now again, apparently, that means that you now see which ones you hit. And yeah, it says you found two high value boxes. These will be highlighted on your next run. So that means that you can just make more points because you already know which ones did you hit. But I must say, I'm still saying the same. It is too expensive, my friends. It is seriously too expensive. Uh, one euro for each run. Mm -mm, mm -mm. This is... Uh, they need to work on that a little bit. Well, not everything is perfect, right? Not everything is perfect. Let's see. Um, regarding new cars, which new cars do we actually have available? Um, as it looks like, we're going here again regarding... Um, we have new Porsche cars available. So we will... Cars of the day. Can we check this? Okay. That's different. Uh, we want to see... New. There we go. 
the new part. Okay, we got the Porsche 365 Speedster, a D-Class car, old school, very, very old school. Okay, 50. Okay, what are we hitting here? Nitro of 0 0.85, 254, 6005 handling, traction 0 0.4. Um, then we have. Did we have that one before? Man, I'm, I'm lost. Is that new? Could be new, right? If I don't have it, then it's new. <laughs> kind of like this. Okay, so we have the okay, the 918 Spider. This one I have 959. Yes, it's so funny that the 959 in I think in top drives it's a legendary, and here it's an A class car. <laughs> so then we have the 718 GT4 Club Sport. Beautiful. We have the 1997, the 2004 Power Carrera GT. Is that that is new? I think. That wasn't in it yet. 1970, ah, beautiful Porsche 930 Turbo. Then the 1927. Ah, I think the 968 Club Sport feels new to me. It feels new to me. This one, then the 2004 Porsche Carrera GT, and the Speedster. Then how does the clubs look like? I mean, we have a new, we have a new season. As you can see, here we go. Unfortunately, still, we're not able. I'm not able to like set things there's no chat there's no request there's no boost uh, which is a bit annoying which is seriously is a bit annoying here um no no i don't want to kick um but i would just like to make it a little bit more you know a little bit more open it's like currently we are with 4000 let's see how is the rest doing Whoa, snipers already 1.4 million yeah obviously it must be a new car because it is a price car right now. The 1993 Porsche 968 Club Sport is a price car. What can you win? Oh, gold. Huge amount of gold there. 1,000. Was it always like this? Always so much? Okay, 750 here for 2 until 5. And 500. Okay, so. Oh, is there anything else we can do here? Can we do it again? No, we can't, right? No, it costs money. That's what I mean. That's what I mean. Then we have the club season three. Season, okay, Carrera. We need the 356 Speedster, which we will definitely go for. I will open some crates. And I'm thinking, I'm thinking of maybe should we go do a little giveaway? Maybe regarding the newest, um, the newest challenges and the newest Rebel Pass. By the way, those are the challenges as you can see here. Um, those are the daily challenges on the left and you can get points and those points if they look different for you they you can like unlock them here as you can see step by step those will unlock more things all the way until the beautiful uh, 2015 roof RT35S so ladies and gentlemen what do you think of the newest update i definitely i'm a fan of passes i like to see what i'm working for that is not bad and um, i would like to see something in top price as well i always was asking for that no it didn't come yet i must say i'm a bit tired of of porsche I at least finally drop some off-roaders i'm so in love with the whole off-road theme in this game that i really want to see i really want to see the next off-road it's time for some off-roaders. Stop dropping those. I mean, I'm going to go. I'm going to get them. I'm going to get them, but I want some off-roaders. Ladies and gentlemen, let me know down below what you think of the newest update. I wish you a pleasant day. That was the Casual Mobile Gamer, and I'm out.